All right, so the question asks, the quantity represents a real number. Find any restrictions on x. So what does that mean? That means is there any situation that x um, can't be, as in turns the denominator into a zero? Um, here I think we can see pretty quickly that there's a solution. I think it looks like it might be 42. Um, so you get to that pretty easy. Um, you just move that. Okay, so you do everything on both sides, right? So you add that seven to both sides and you end up with one half of whatever this x is, is gonna be equal to 21. Well, I mean, you can just intuitively say, well, what is 21 one half of? Or you can multiply both sides by 2 over 1, or just 2, whatever, same thing, you can just say 2. And that becomes a 1, so x is equal to 21 times 2 is 42. So, we've got a solution now. We know that x has to be 42, which means um, that there is not a restriction, um, because we have Specifically, we have a solution. So, um, in the blank, the notation is actually a little confusing, in my opinion, on this. So, in your box, um, where you would fill it in, um, on this particular one, you would just write none as uh, instructed on the directions.